Hey, what's up guys? The Meds Guy. Welcome back to Dark Cloud. This is so much better than going through the pain of Sonic Frontiers hard mode where nonsense just happens for no reason and it has nothing to do with the enemies. <laughs> or even the difficulty. Let me get a sip of drink real quick. Mmm. Quite good. I was disappointed to find out that I can't play uh, Dead Space Remake until uh, like 10 a.m. So we're starting that sometime tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, that's first person. L1 and R1 do some camera work. Reminds me of Sonic Adventure 2. That's Triangle, that's what Triangle does. A big keyhole. Use item with square? Do I have? Oh, a big cakey. Boom! Sickle mode. And we shmoove. The Divine Beast Cave. Uh, well, I guess Basement 1 is where we're going right now. Oh man, I got the... I got the curved sword on lock. Oh, it's dude! <clears throat> it's for real this time, Tone. From here on, you will be put to the true test. First, conquer this wretched divine beast's cave and find Dron's lair. That's your first goal. Since you're a beginner, I'll give you a lesson on how to fight in the dungeon. First, to advance to the next floor in a dungeon, acquire a gate key for the door leading to the next floor. Each dungeon has a different gate key. For the divine beast cave, Dron's crest will be the gate key. The gate key is almost always carried by a monster in the dungeon. You must defeat the monsters to acquire the gate key. Since you can't tell which one has the key, you just have to defeat them all one by one. Next, I'll tell you about how to return to the ground level rather than advancing to the floor below. To return to ground level, mind connect with me. In other words, speak with your mind. When you do this, I will transport your body to the ground level. Just select leave dungeon from the main menu. But be aware, if there are monsters left on the floor, the mind connect won't work. It will be blocked by their evil energies. In such cases, use the item escape powder to get out on your own. The No Rune Village Chief has lots of it, so be sure to get it before you go. You can also mind connect with me when you go through the gate to the next floor of a dungeon. When you re-enter the dungeon, you can start at the next new level so you don't have to worry about losing progress. Next, it's on to weapons. Be aware that weapons are breakable. The more you use a weapon, the more it wears and finally breaks. Broken weapons will disappear. To prevent weapons from breaking, use the item Repair Powder. It will restore their weapon power. The longer you use a me weapon by repairing, the more magic it absorbs from monsters and thus becomes stronger. It's said that when a weapon reaches its full strength, it can change to a more powerful form. Keep that in mind. Oh. I cast a spell on the dagger you have on you so it'll never disappear. But all the new weapons you will get during the quest will disappear once they break. So be careful. Why wouldn't they just... <laughs> Why wouldn't you give me an unlimited spell for everything? Don't waste your hard work by letting a weapon break and disappear. Why don't you just enchant them all? Finally, the important stuff. The sphere. Atla where I protected and sealed the fragments of the world. If you see an Atla, don't hesitate to touch it. You can absorb the contents of an Atla into Atla me uh, by touching it. When you return to the surface, you will be able to re begin reassembling these fragments of the world. Oops. 
Today's lesson ran a little long. That's it for the lecture today. Now, Toad, show me your true ability on this quest. Off I go. <laughs> He's like, what the heck did he just say to me? Hold on. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'll use my mind connect. I'll use my mind connect. I have to go to the boy and make sure that I actually have that stuff. I, I don't know. What happening? What happening? What's going on here? Oh, okay. Time moves quick as heck in this game, huh? I forgot to grab your items! Now our only hope is Dron. Dron has always watched over us. I'm sure Dron has watched us this time too, and will help us. But really this time, even Dron's windmill, where Dron's magic power dwells, is destroyed. Okay, I guess I was wrong. Oh well, my bad guys. <laughs> I gave him a new voice, that way he don't sound like the, uh... The teacher guy. I... You see, Toad is, like, super flat. But, um... He might just be... He's either a he and he's a child, or it's a woman. And I don't know because nobody's referred to me by a gender. <laughs> but the swing sound effect is feminine or childish. Oh boy! Get wrecked! Oh, that's Atla. I was about to break that thing. I got a fence. <laughs> What am I going to do with a fence? I'm going to keep with the trunks voice. The trunks-esque voice, I should say. Oh, come here. Uh-oh. Oh no. I require a poison heal. I need... What's this? Water... Antidote drink? I'm gonna have to use that. Fire gem, nice. Speed plus one, yes sir. And, photo final. Repair powder, yay. Nope, that's not what I wanted it. Item. Fire gem. Neat, um, bread. <laughs> I got bread. I might have to get some health back, bro. I got... I got bread, right? And then I got... The fire gym, and I got the repair powder. I got the fire gym, something in the repair powder. Uh, I don't got nothing for that yet, I don't think. Yeah, 
idiot. <laughs> Never should have fought me. I have the power of running away and coming back on my side. More opera. What is this? What's it gonna be? Trees. <laughs> what am I gonna do with trees? Oh, oh my god. That was just a depth, depth, depth perception thing. Undoubtedly. Can I get a, an antidote? I got Dron's Quest! Uh, Dron's... What, what is it called? Dron's Request? Dron's... Quest? No, Dron's Crest? There it is. The... Daggone! What the, what up with the cherry, though? Road? <laughs> Sim City. I'm gonna have to get something to heal. Road. Okay, so... What is this? That's the key to the boss room. I am poisoned, um... Well, this is incredibly useful, but not right now. How do I use this? What is this for? Oh, I can't use this right now. Okay. Oh, um, I think I'm gonna die, because I don't have any more antidote. I used the one that I had, and I don't have any more healing items. So all I can do is get this Atla. Macho's house. Macho man is... It's Macho man is... No! I, I had the first. Tone is nearly destroyed. Not completely. <laughs> no, guys, I'm fine. Just leave me here. I'll sleep it off. <laughs> Dude, these bats are stronger than I am. I just casually walled Sarah. No problem. Ah! Ah, Seems like you've finally come back with some Atla. Very well then, I shall teach you, as promised. The pieces sealed inside Atla are released by touching the Atla with your left hand, where the power of Atla Mia resides. Buildings and people that were sucked into the Atla Mia will be restored to their original form. Once you bring them back to the ground level, you can arrange them as you wish by going back and forth between the dungeon and ground level, you can restore the earth to its original form. That's your mission as the one who was granted the power of Atlamia. Now let us move on. This may get a bit technical. If you wanted to place buildings, etc., press the select button while walking and go to edit mode. <laughs> edit mode? Press the select button again to return to walking mode. In edit mode, you can reassemble buildings that have fallen apart and place them on the ground. Seeing is believing. Try it yourself. Must be faster than listening to my lecture. Agreed. Oh yes, and if you ever forget the things I teach you, use this. It's a book. Oh, the manual. It's a guide for using Atlamia. It's an IKEA guide for building a desk. And other things, like Atlamia. I wrote you for... I... I wrote it. Manual can be selected from the main menu. Read it really carefully. Okay, I leave the world's reconstruction to you. I'll be watching. <laughs> so long. 
Here I go. What the heck? All right, let's pause. This is select. Geo Rama. I'm gonna put Macho's house in, and it's going. To, Macho's house goes in the corner. Oh wait, no, that ain't what I meant to do. Put five trees right here next to Macho's house. Having a bad day, aren't you? No roads for Macho. I, I'll save the roads for later. Though, actually. Uh, what is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, Macho, you got a chest outside your house. It's mine now. Bread. Macho, I'm a fan of your bread. Oh no. <laughs> He's got a wrestling ring bed. He is really Macho Man. Oh my gosh. How horrifying. <laughs> Macho, where'd your music go? Oh. What is R2 actually doing? Except for putting me in, because that's half. Oh, excuse me, goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Cold chill. Every now and again, I'll press R2 and it'll be like, oh, yes, this is the time of day that it is. Honestly, I kind of want to play a game that's just all of the cutscenes or something. <laughs> because I, I really enjoyed those first, like, opening cutscenes of being able to do that. I little bit of the gameplay, I can't, I can't go all out. Like I was. Oh. I need to drink some water. Oh, okay. Did I ever come this way? The Dasher, a most pathetic enemy. Oh, I need to use... You see, I thought it was supposed to be invincible, though. Lamp. A magical crystal. Oh, that looks like it's just straight up tells me where everything in the area is. Yeah. What's this? Oh. Oh, well, I don't have... Oh, I don't get to keep... Drawings... Whatever. On my thing. I assume that is a drawn... The door that I was supposed to use drawings quit thing on. I apparently... Ah, oh, I just wasted that. Why didn't the game tell me how to use items? I feel bad now. Yo, what's up? Get wrecked, buddy. Bread. You have a shield, my guy. Come on. Drawn's quest! I keep saying quest. Oculus Quest! Where's the bat? Where's the bat? There's the bat. I need the dasher to go away and the bat to come to me. Post haste! 
No! I don't want to be poisoned! I'm, I'm gonna get poisoned! I hate bad enemies. How do how per per? Oh, I guess I can't do that. I guess I can't use it on my dagger. I have to use it on a different weapon. Banana. <laughs> Yo, what's good? Of course, it's like a salty banana. Uh-oh. I need to go get that drawn gate open to be factual. If this is a drawn gate. Is this the entrance? Maybe that was the entrance. Maybe the skull gate was... There's a gotla right here. Macho! <laughs> I don't really need to go that way. Ugh. Okay. Ah, of course. No water, huh? Try and run away from it. I got a whole river. Oh god. Bonky. No. I didn't know there was a guard button. <laughs> My apologies, I meant to use that on myself. I know. Okay, let's leave the dungeon. I didn't read that bottom text, so if it was like, if you leave the dungeon now, you won't get nothing. I'll be back. Okay. Uh, we'll go into edit mode real quick. Cause I got, I got Macho. We gotta put Macho in. Oh, there we go. Oh. I don't know what to use that with then. Oh, okay, cool. I can like teleport with it. I'll have to remember that. Let's go chat with Macho. Huh? Macho! I guess not. <laughs> I gotta go chat with daggone dude over here. And then I'm gonna end the episode. Big sad. 
There's going to be no easy task. I put some items you'll be needing in your bag. Be careful, okay? So what items do I have? Am I still thirsty? Yes. Oh, useful. Oh, that's, that's weapon. Oh. All right, we are in good state. And we got all of the items we need. So next time we'll continue back into the dungeon. Uh, to get stuff, you know, get more stuff done. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, if you more, subscribe if you're on reasons. I'll see you in the next one.